Good day, YouTubers, and welcome to the vlog. I am in Bob's limo, and we are heading down to the uh, the airport right now. It's got a little construction happening coming up, but uh, everything's looking good. I uh, got up in time. I don't. I never sleep well before I go on a trip. Uh, I always think I'm gonna sleep in or something's gonna go wrong, so I'm always like waking up like every hour on the hour. Uh, but today I woke up. Uh, I think I woke up about 10 minutes too early because I was just kind of standing in the kitchen going, hmm, what do I do now? But uh, we're all packed up. I got my San Francisco hat on. Uh, it's as close as I got for a California hat at the moment. I had to get an Oakland Raiders hat. I believe that the Raiders used to be the football team for LA and then they moved. So I'll have to get a Raiders hat as soon as possible. Anyway, guys, we're heading down and uh, we'll talk to you at the airport. Let's go. Okay, we are at the Tim Hortons on uh, 400 southbound. I talked Bob into buying him a coffee. <laughs> I said, I'll buy you a coffee if we stop. And he's like, okay. So I'm gonna go grab my regular large double-double and he takes, he likes the regular coffee, but it's black, nothing else. All right, we're at the airport. Uh, so I arrived in the, uh, the Lincoln, Navigator or whatever it's called the Lincoln something which is nice. It's a nice ride You can't get out <laughs> All right, so let's get into the airport Get our ticket. I can't remember. I've just booked in I uh, got my Boarding pass and everything, but I'm not checking a bag in and I can't remember if I can just walk through We'll find out in a second. So you have to uh, fill out the form because the machines aren't working. Which is funny, because I'm like, maybe I shouldn't bring a pen, because you don't have to use a pen anymore. Wrong. Filled up my form. Now we're going to the US of A. So I was just about to go through those gates, and then she told me I had to go all the way down to aisle 15, which doesn't make sense whatsoever. Never done that. I guess we'll find out. Oh, well, it turns out the machines that are automated that do this stuff now, uh, they're down. And they only have three guys working the customs thing, so, and tons and tons of people are starting to pile through the door, so they're getting backed up like crazy. So this is a holding pen. And uh, I'm basically three hours early, so I have to sit here until they fix the problems. Oh boy. Good thing I had my coffee already. All right, customs is open. And uh, it'll be much nicer to be on that side of customs rather than this side of customs. Making us walk all the way back. I'd rather just waited in line. I can't remember what I was gonna say. And we're back. I just remembered to t what I was gonna tell you, which is you can't videotape inside the customs area, so camera off, good boy. We made it through customs. It's only, I actually registered my declaration card thingy at 5.33, it is now 6.08. I got two hours before my flight, basically an hour and a half before boarding. So we're good to go. Hope I'm on the right side of the airport. All right, here's a Ken rant. Okay, so this bag was uh, 25, I think, pounds, uh, but it had to be 22 pounds. And she stopped, she stopped me as I was going through and she's like, uh, sir, can you put the, try to put the bag in the thing? Of course it wouldn't fit because it was a little wide. Uh, so she's like, and we're gonna, we're gonna weigh it too. And I'm like, okay, I know it fits because it's an Air Canada bag. I bought it specifically because I'm flying Air Canada. Uh, so of course, and then she's like, oh, you have to check it because it's overweight. I'm like, well, can I move some of the, some of the stuff from here into there? And she's like, okay, <laughs> so I do. 
and of course I got it down to 22 pounds and okay we're on so now all I'm gonna do is move that shit back in from there into there thanks Air Canada okay enough of that rant uh, the other thing too is just my sandals a pair of shorts two pairs of shorts and sandals was the extra three pounds that I had to take out one bag so I left the shorts in my carry-on computer bag look at that sunshine we're at exit uh, gate F71 I got about another hour and a half to kill so I'm at Tim Hortons I'm gonna grab the Canadian back bacon breakfast sandwich and a milk I'm also the half browns too all right guys airport food review Tim Hortons style so a large milk back bacon sandwich and a uh, hash browns I'm gonna obviously right off the top and give this a would not recommend because they burnt my browns if I had the energy I'd walk back there and just make them give me a new one but why should I I'm gonna eat it and give it a bad rating mmm thanks for the burnt hash browns I cannot believe they would pass that off to a customer always check your bag people always check the bag so right off the top burnt hash browns do not recommend ew okay as for the back bacon sandwich let's give it a shot a little back bacon there Canadian back bacon it looked like there's gonna be pea meal on it in the picture but there's not that's going for a bite That's a good sandwich. The eggs are what you'd expect at a fast food joint where it's all pre-made and all that. Possibly, I might be wrong, but the back bacon's really good. I'll rate this, uh, I would recommend for sure. It's very good. Ham on these kind of sandwiches is okay, but back bacon is a plus. Mm. And this all came to seven dollars, even well six ninety eight, and then we round up to the seven, so seven bucks. So there you go, a little restaurant review just for you. All right, guys, here's another tip for you when you go to the airport or you're traveling: bring your own water bottle. That'll save you a lot of money. Uh, I think there's a water bottle in there that's definitely less water than that and it's a dollar 79 here I've seen water up to, uh, up as high as like four dollars so save yourself the money bring your own bottle um, and you just go to a restaurant and ask them to fill it up out of their tap there you go just realized that <clears throat> I don't have a seat I'm classified as GTE I don't know what that means uh, I hope this doesn't interfere with me getting a window seat. Just realized when they first opened up the gate or up their uh, little booth here, I should have uh, approached them right away to see if I get a window seat. So it looks like I'm not going to get landing and takeoff footage unless I can talk somebody out of their window seat. We're finally through the gate, heading down the ramp. And it looks like it's one of those uh, really nice wide body jets with all those amazing first-class seats I'll let you know when we get there what kind of plane it is well as you can see I'm very far away from the window uh, this is a three three and three seating plan 27d which means for disgusting. It's an awful seat. Very happy I got a window seat. Got to switch with somebody, which is awesome, but we're over a wing. At least we can see some stuff. This is that quiet plane. It's the uh, Boeing 777. 
guys. All right, guys, so I got to switch my seat from over there to over here because a lady and her husband were separated. These two young ladies here are going to be accompanying me as, sec as security. What's your name? I'm Melanie. Melanie. I'm Kathy. And Kathy. And where are you guys headed? Los Angeles. To do what? Redondo Beach. Oh, okay. To party with the girls. Six so it's a girls, three six bedrooms. Six girls, three bedrooms, five beds, pillow five fights. Days. Yeah, I knew. Pillow. See, I knew the guys always think that. That's right. I said that That's all they do. Yesterday. Pillow fights, do their hair, <laughs> giggle like they're doing now. Drinking a lot of wine. A lot of wine. A lot of wine. Yes. Well, Some that's that's a, that's a given, right? <laughs> Girl, six girls on a beach, wine. That's right. Or beer. Not shopping. And shopping. <laughs> there's there's got to be shopping oh, close by. A little bit. Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'll have a safe flight. Thank, Thank you. you. Takeoff time was 8.35. We'll see what time we get there. All right, guys, it is lunchtime. Uh, what did you order? We're gonna, we're gonna do a, a three-way uh, rating system. Here we go. So what did you order? Made good chocolate banana granola minis. Okay. Organic with not wild vegetables and school safe without peanuts. Nice. Pretty so good, did, I'd recommend. She's, she's giving it a recommend. Now, what did you order here? I ordered the Quaker oatmeal Would you like a straw with that? Yes. If I look at this, I'm going to be eating this till noon because of the size of the spoon. Yikes. This is good though. This yeah. is orange juice and sparkling water. Yeah. Orange juice and sparkling water. I went total gangster with this uh, old fashioned uh, Molson Canadian. I got the beef sandwich. This is a, called the Trio. It's $14.95. You save uh, $3.50 supposedly when you order all three. Uh, as opposed to ordering each individually. Uh, let's give the sandwich a shot. It looks like it's um, oh, just a regular it's bun. Or almost, it's almost... Uh, yeah, but it looks like it has onions on it. It's like very, very... So it looks like an onion bun, lettuce, cheese, uh, meat, and it looks like there's like an onion thing on the bottom. Not a good presentation, definitely. Heavy on the, um, it's like a, it's like a um, Dijon mustard kind of thing. It's okay. That would be uh, for this flight. It would be a recommend. I've had the pizza. I've had this. I've had the wrap. The wrap is good, but it has um, cucumbers in it, and they won't they won't take it off. So you had to pull them out yourself. Anyway, so there's uh, another. Airplane food review just for you and the girls. We are 26 miles away from the airport, <clears throat> so we're still above the clouds.
No, it's your time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it'd be like 12, 1.30, I guess, in Toronto. 120. 1.20. Yeah, Toronto time. Okay, so 1.20, yeah. That's good when I get it wrong. It's funny. We are exiting the plane. As you can see. Thank you. Have fun. Don't drink too much. <laughs> Bad advice from me to them. Uh, I saw actually uh, one of the guys from Epic Mealtime, but he's now disappeared into the void called LAX. I gotta find my shuttle as fast as possible. Uh, so I'm gonna have to pull over, look at my sheet figure it out. There's the uh, very famous LAX airport building. There's that suspended pod. That's when you know you're in LA. Alright guys, sitting like two rows ahead of me was Josh from Epic Mealtime. As you already know. This is your Ken. You're this Ken, is and like, I'm Ken. You're way from more KBD Productions TV. Hell yeah. <laughs> so I just uh, thought I'd say hi to him and, and he's uh, going to a movie premiere tonight. VidCon bound though. That's we're right. VidCon bound and we're gonna have a fucking awesome time. It's gonna be rocking. Hell yeah. We'll see you there. Alright man. See you man. Take it easy. Bye. Alright guys, we're on the shuttle from LAX to Anaheim and of course the whole shuttle is dedicated to us awesome youtubers. So what's your name? John. John, what's your channel? Van Pants. Sir. Nick. Adex Media. Dylan also Adex Media. Patrick, Beast That Plays. Nice. And we have an agent here to sell our souls for us. That's awesome. And Cherry Pie Fitness. Cherry Pie Fitness, that's what I need. Fitness in my life. <laughs> you ate it on the gate. Excellent. <laughs> I like that. Okay, people, we are at the Clarion. I doubt I can book in, but I'm gonna try. If I can't get in, I'll, uh, I think, dude, where's my challenge is already here. And if they are here, I'm gonna go hang with them and, and drink all their booze. They won't have booze, are you kidding? They're English, they don't drink. <laughs> all right, so we are in Anaheim. And that is the convention center right there. And I'm gonna take you down to the sign. I'm gonna check to see if people are around so we can do some partying. Do some handshaking, picture taking, video collabing. Whatever we can do, this bud's for you. So here's a tip for you. If you wanna stay here, stay at the Hilton, Marriott, because VidCon's right there. You could literally walk right out of your hotel, right into VidCon. <clears throat> That's just my first observation. We got girls on roller skates, skateboards, partying, great way to get around. Awesome. And there's VidCon people. Finally after what, seven years? So I'm like trying to find Hey boys! What the? That is oh, mad. How's it going, man? How are you doing? Hi. Oh yeah, go on, go in for the hogs. Do the hogs, guys. How's it going? What uh, are the chances of that? Right? I literally <laughs> thought you just <laughs> landed. Uh, I that's... love you, man. I watch you on the internet. <laughs> I don't believe it. It's, they're real. I'm telling you guys. These guys are real. I just, uh, yeah. so I don't have your email address and I don't have your phone number. I have your phone number. But, oh, uh, what is, what are you like? Six? Well, I just, I just literally got dropped off like 10 minutes ago. Walked wow. through here to take a picture. I'm just posted of, it. I'm glad you don't send naked pictures to me. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's not going in the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, let's party. Yeah, so I'm going to get the booze and then you get the. Hey, this uh, is your second time, right? Yeah. yeah with no, with no, virgins. No. Yeah, we're With virgins. Okay. Yeah, you know, Ben, have you? Uh, uh, this is my first time, so. <laughs> 
Don't worry, we'll so break you in softly, yeah. <laughs> be gentle. <laughs> How long have we been here in the maze? <laughs> it's gonna get any more homo. Sexual in your eyes are going straight to the top. Straight to the top. We are waiting in line and it's crazy big. As you can see. We're almost at the end. Uh, they actually had us in a single line wrapped many, many, many times through all the hallways and then they finally opened up these doors, let everybody in. I wish I'd known that they were doing it this way because as they were students in, I probably would have got down this row. That's what I would like to have done. I didn't think about that. But I think they were guiding us. We should have ran down We should have like walked slower. We should have, well, there was no barrier this time. We could have just walked over. Yeah. Drop your, drop your pen. <laughs> Come on, guys. This is where I park my car. Drop this. Don't. That's what happened to uh -oh. the egg the other day. He threw a baseball at me in Walmart yesterday. He threw a baseball at me, and I wonder, I wonder why it hit a shelf free. It's like I'm babysitting. <laughs> How I'm, dare I'm, you? I'm babysitting the English today. Yeah. Pip, pip. Blame Canada. Pip, pip. Blame Canada. <laughs> All right, guys, we are in uh, Do Where's My Challenge hotel room, and there's a lot of craziness going on in here. <laughs> Cheers, guys. Good beers. Nice. To VidCon 2000. <laughs> That's clever. That is perfect. But let's just take a quick, quick look around at some of the problems that we might be having. That might be a problem for me, the Francis. Uh, and then we have this stuff here. That's a big box of condoms. Lots of stuff. Oh. Am I giving your stuff away? Yeah, sure, man. Well, no, it, well, it makes them want to know what we're going to do with those things. Right? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're not telling them what they're doing. We're, we're telling them. the fun on the tube. <laughs> this is where we start sticking eels inside us. Eels? Yes. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a family show. Oh, family show. Oh, sorry. Hello. <laughs> so, so I was trying to teach Paul, Paulie what to do when somebody comes up to him with a microphone and says, Hey, nice burrito shirt. Fuck off. It looks so good. See, up my brain. All right, so we are heading over to Fire and Ice. Matt Zion from Reckless Eating and oh, pool. Yeah, That's... I know your jacuzzi. Yeah, the last person on that died. Yeah, a couple oh. of dead bodies in there. <laughs> then they clean out the dead bodies every night. It is Anaheim, really. Come on. Yeah. So, so we're go going to um, where are we going? Fire and Ice. I prefer Earth, Wind, and Fire myself. Uh, nice. Some tunes. September. <laughs> so this this is my first Uber ride. I can't wait. wait. We're getting an Uber. Uber. Now we're getting Uber. Uber. We're walking. We're getting Uber later. The These guys are like all over the yes. map. We don't have a plan. This could be this could, no. No, you have a plan. It just doesn't work. <laughs> hey, it works. Three hundred thousand subscribers shows well, it works. Did, yeah. Oh. Did, yeah. Oh my. Yeah, somehow I don't know, man. I like the other shirt. It was more fun. Especially in LA. Yeah, I don't really want to wear it around. Yeah. It's, uh, I don't want to. Oh, I don't mind well, 20 bucks. It's bucks. 20 bucks, really. Yeah, so at the end of the day, it is. So I just booked into the room. Now we're heading over to see uh, Matt and a bunch of the other guys at Fire and Ice, I believe. And these guys are like out of, con out of control craziness. That's what they are. <laughs> He's supposed to let go of it. Hello, I think my friends are here. Yeah, they're We're supposed to be crashing a party. Hey, hey boys. Hey. Hey. How are you? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. No, no. Oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How you doing, buddy? How you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing? Hey, Eric. How are you? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Finally. Hey, Eric. How are you doing? So this is, this is the gang is all here. Yeah, how are you, sir? Yeah, I'm right. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hello? How are you? How are you? Oh, is anybody hey, sitting here? No, you are. You are doing it. So how was your dinner? Uh, it was pretty good. Yeah. Pretty how, good. How did you rate 
Look at this thing. Look at this. That is nice. This was delicious. It looks uh, like it was because you finished it. Melon flavored. Melon flavored. Okay. Yeah. How was your day? Can I compare? Sure. That it's hot. I can. How you doing, buddy? I'm gonna lick your your head one of these days. Though I promised you on the phone, I will lick it. Okay. Okay. Aaron, how was your dinner? Do it. It was really good. I got yeah, something spicy. <laughs> you, uh, you didn't get something spicy. Of course I did. Why would you do that? Because for science. <laughs> for science. How was your dinner? Uh, it was delicious. It was full of calamari and other meats. Deep fried? No, unfortunately not. No? How was your dinner here at Ice? Uh, uh, it, it was uh, interesting. Yeah? Interesting. They, they will allow you to put things together that don't necessarily go together. <laughs> Yes, it is. Ignorance. We can we can blame this on me, but uh, yeah, it's uh, don't come here if you don't know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like that a lot of fun. I'm being abused at the liquor store. It's not good. Sexual. Sexual. I did. Look, it's out. Bunch of YouTubers and a beer store. Oh my god. That's crazy, isn't it? It can only lead to disaster in a beautiful way. In a beautiful way. Yeah. Only on KBD Productions TV will you see this. Have you had the Clemais? That's so bad. I had the Takei one. George Takei is in alcohol form in there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. He shared one of our videos. Oh, what? That's awesome. Yeah, man. Almost like Jesus Christ. Which one? Uh, George Takai shared uh, dog, you know, like the man vs. dog video where we did the spaghetti. He shared it, it's the most cute thing I've ever seen. I was like, have you seen your boy, like, husband's ass? Like, that's the thing I've seen. I'm happy. All right, guys, we're back from the adventures outside the hotel. I forgot to show you what the hotel room looks like. There's a outer sink area here, toilet, shower in there. Then we've got bed here. That will be Dame Drop's bed. That will be my bed. Uh, we've got a little office. A little bit of a concrete thing going on there. I don't know what that is. Got a so pull out sofa just in case we had an extra guest. We weren't sure. Then we've got a uh, good view of, that's Disneyland. Like right there. And those are the California mountains in the background, as you can see. Very nice view. I'm impressed with the view. It's a very nice view. And we've got the uh, fridge. No beers whatsoever. We've got a heating unit called a microwave. And now we're going down to uh, Colt Moo's room. And we're going to party. That's the secret code. Don't memorize. That's the secret code. Don't, hey, me don't, hey. don't, don't, don't memorize it. Don't memorize it. Camera. When you knocked, that was, that was the just for you and just for you knock. <laughs> I didn't even notice I did that. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello. How are you, Dave? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm going to put my beer over here. My legal beer. <laughs> like, as it didn't go by, you went, hey, where's my luggage? <laughs> <laughs> Chuck is in the building. How's it going, man? Hey, man, how you doing? Hey, good to see you. Chuck Rowland really took care of himself, man. It's looking good. Just because I hugged him doesn't mean everybody else has to hug him. It's like, it's my he's thing. He's my friend. But he's my friend. Hey. Oh, there you go. Hello, Fee. Go for it. All right. I love it. I love it. And I'm with KBD Productions oh, TV, just for you. And uh, what, what, you, what, you, what are you on, six or seven? Here, get in here. What, six or seven what? Uh, drinks, man, I gotta play catch up right now. You do? Yeah. We, we've got some, we got some catching up to do this for you. This is all I wanted to do. I've got, got lots of beers. This is VidCon. This is what VidCon's supposed to be right now. <laughs> Having fun. Beers. Having fun with some awesome content creators and letting loose, so I cannot wait. It's I am so excited. What time did you leave? When, uh, what time did we leave? We, we left uh, at like New York. 8 a.m. Oh, we left at like 8 Oh my gosh. Dame, Dame what just, was your layover? Uh, four or five four hours. hours. Yeah. 
Dude. Direct oh, flight people. Yeah. That's what it's yeah. all about. Plus, then, you get, then you get extra of these. Yeah, baby. Yeah, oh my god. Or you could be like these guys and be really late. <laughs> yeah, we are. We're late to the party, but that's uh, fashionable, right? Yeah. That's one of those things, so. So, uh, obviously, you guys already know healthy junk food. We have JP and Julia in the house. We're going to go. Dude. We're going to wait for Dame, and then once Dame's yeah. in the house, let's then we'll, we'll take you guys downstairs. Yeah, let's okay. do it. All, all right. Party. Cool. <laughs> all right, guys. We have Dame drops in the drink. house. Oh, oh, going on? I'm here, baby. Buddy. It's on, man. It's How's on. Going, man? What's going on, good brother? How you feeling? All right. <sighs> How was I'm the flight, sir? 17 hours? <laughs> it really sucked. It felt like I was going much further than what I needed to go. <sighs> Detroit. Three hours in Detroit, man. No. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that was special. Mm -hmm. But, you know what? We're here. We're here. We made it. If you'd like to relax, sit down. No, nah, man, I'm not even about relaxing. We, okay. We, I'm going to just keep running There's like I run out of steam. 12 people on the exact same floor underneath us right now partying if you'd like to oh, go down nice, and say hi nice. to some people. We're right, good to go. We're going to do that. We're going to say hi to some people. I got to call up uh, Matt Centura because he was waiting for me to call him when I got to my room. I'm yeah, being followed by call Dame call Drops. Oh, no, it's just crazy. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was saying. I, I, and I, I, JP. Rocks out the league a lot better than, than yeah, yeah, SUV. Yeah, yeah. X3 is real embarrassing. I can't roll, I can't roll yeah. with that. Well, I, I kind of felt like, you know, rich dad. That's about yeah. it. You know what I mean? I didn't feel like gangster dad. I no, like no, rich dad. You're talking with X3. You can yeah. talk with X5. Yeah. Heading down I, to the party. Know. Go ahead. Uh, I don't even, I don't even uh, knock. Uh, just, uh, just bust up in here. Uh, hey, what's up, boys and girls? Hey, hey, what's up, hey, what's up, hey, what's up how's it going? Are you feeling it? What's going on, Fox? Yeah. Yeah. What's up, boss? You feeling that? Yeah, yeah. I love being the only girl. Everybody knows you. Nice to meet you. This is JP. Julia. They are YouTubers. Toro. We got Dame Drops. We got JP. Yeah. Julia. Healthy junk food. <laughs> Just waiting. Waiting for some healthy junk food right now. Dame is doing the secret text. Yeah, yeah. He's Te texting it. my He's boy Matt Santoro to tell him to come on down. Nice. Bring it in, man. Oh, where the fun is? Yeah. Space, man. Nice. That's me. From Memphis, Tennessee. <laughs> they got the best moonshine. Good morning. Uh, it is Thursday, July 23rd, and uh, Damon and I are just getting ready to, to head out. Um, I just wanted to basically, after we were talking with Matthew and all them, uh, and Josh. Just basically, it was like four o'clock in the morning our time, so we just came back, talked for a bit, and then and then crashed. I was out like gone, um, but uh, we have a whole new day for you. Hang on.